To change how an image is zoomed in or positioned on your canvas in Descript, click on the layer. So click on it here in the canvas. Go to this layer button on the right side, and you'll see this box that says size and position. If it's closed, you'll need to toggle it open with that little arrow right there. And there is an X and Y axis, and this is where the image is positioned in the frame. So if I click in there and move it around, you can see those X and Y numbers moving. You can also click in there and change it by typing in there. And then below that is a W and H that would be your height and width. And if you click in there, you can also slide it and change it like this. Or you can click on the corners of the image and resize it like this. Or click on the corners and that'll resize it proportionally. And this little link right there is locking these numbers together so it stays proportionate. If you click it, it'll unlink it. And now if I make a change to one of those numbers, it'll change the height without changing the width. So, but by default, it's locked just so you don't get yourself in trouble with distorting the image. The one below that is your rotation. So if you click, you can slide it and you can see it's moving that image off of zero degrees. There's 90 degrees all the way up to 360 degrees so you can rotate it completely. And then your last one, and let me make this a little smaller so you can see what this one will do, is your corner rounding. So if I click in there and I type in a number like 100, you can see that the corner just rounded. And you can take this number all the way up really high to get super round corners like that where this is now an oval. And if you click on this little thing in the bottom right, that's going to open up all four corners. If you just change that first number, the one that we were just looking at, that's going to change all four corners at once. But if you click on this, you can granularly change top left, top right, bottom left, bottom right individually. If you like this one, be sure to check out this video next.